In our home index, the section that we will designate as our header is everything from the doc type down to the closing of the header tag. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this out and in its place I'm going to put in the expression engine tag that embeds or includes other files. The syntax for this is really simple and this will be our first expression engine tag that we look at but all of the expression engine tags have this formatting of being open and closed with curly braces. So this is an open and curly brace and we're going to type the word embed equal to and then similar to how we did the style sheet we will put in the template group and then template name of the file that we want to embed so in our case we're going to say embed embeds forward slash header and you could wrap this around in quotation marks or leave it without it'll technically work without we'll go ahead and just uh, put them in for Make sure that it works. And notice this format again is saying embed and then the file that you're going to embed preceded by the template group for it. So let's go ahead, update and finish this, and go back to our embeds and paste in the embed for our header. Go ahead, update and finish that. And if we come back to our site and refresh it, it shouldn't look any different because the embed is working. So now that we know that that works, we can go ahead and take our home nav and cut that out. In its place, we'll add embed embeds forward slash aside. come back into our beds aside, paste that in there, go back to our home page, and then grab all of our footer content, cut that out, and replace it with embed, embeds, forward slash dot, Footer. Go ahead and save that and the last one here. Come back, paste our footer in, and once that is all done, we'll come back, just test our page and make sure that everything looks good. And it does. So now that we have all of these embeds set up we can begin duplicating this home page and just swapping out the main content and that will help give us that consistent header, sidebar, and footer that we have on our index page.